Hey guys, welcome back to Tony Zaktus. In this video, I'll be showing you Opera GX vs Chrome Web Browser, which is better. Before we start, hurry up and check out these offer just on this video. Let's get started. So if you're deciding between Opera GX here or Chrome, well, there are a few things that you need to understand. So when you first look at Opera GX, it's immediately or it immediately feels different from a regular browser. Now it's actually designed around the idea of performance in, and gaming. So one of its most standout features is something called GX Control. This gives you or gives you sliders to control how much CPU and RAM the browser is allowed to use. So that means if you're playing a game or running heavy apps, Opera GX won't eat up all your system resources the way some other browsers do. It's like having a performance manager built right into your browser. Now, beyond performance here, Opera GX also brings a lot of built-in features Now you'd normally need extensions for, not in Chrome. Now, there is a free VPN here, a built-in ad blocker, and even a video pop-out tool. So you can keep watching a video in the corner of your screen while working on something else. Now, it, where it really stands out, out though is the customization. Now, you can tweak its entire look with animated teams, RGB effects, and sound packs, which is honestly pretty cool. I used it before. And yeah, so making the browser feels more or, or almost like part of your gaming setup. Now, another big win here for Opera GX is its gaming integration. Now, you can connect Discord, Twitch, and directly in the sidebar so you don't have to switch apps to check messages or see who's streaming. Plus, it has a GX corner, a hub that gives you quick access to gaming news, deals, and upcoming releases. Now, for gamers, it's like your browser comes becomes a dashboard that connects you to all the pieces together. So yeah, let's go and move on into Chrome. Now, Chrome is still one of the most popular browsers in the world, so there's a reason for that. Now, its biggest strength is speed and simplicity. Now, Chrome is fast, straightforward, and it works smoothly across devices. Now, if you're signed into a Google account, everything from your bookmarks to your password to your browsing history syncs instantly across your phone, laptop, or desktop. And that level of integration is something Opera GX doesn't quite match as of this moment. Now, another huge advantage here for Chrome is the extension library. The Chrome Web Store, you can find almost any add-on add imaginable here, from productivity tools to entertainment apps. And the downside, though, is that Chrome doesn't come with much built-in. So if you want things like an ad blocker, a VPN, or customization features, you need to install extensions manually. Now, when Chrome tends to fall short is the resource management or usage here. So it's notorious for eating a lot of RAM when you have many tabs open, which can make your computer feel sluggish, especially if you're gaming or multitasking. This is, exa is ex exactly the problem Opera GX tries to solve with GX Control. Now, what's the final verdict here? Well, uh, go for Opera GX uh, because it's a better option or choice if you care about performance, built-in features, and customization, especially if you game or run multiple apps at, at once. Now, go for Google Chrome here uh, if you want speed, simplicity, and seamless integration with Google services like Gmail, Drive, and Docs. So, in short, if you're a gamer, go for Opera GX, but if, you're just, if you just want simplicity and, honestly, uh, the clean interface here, well, Google Chrome is the better option for you. But that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.